the technology used to identify Tamerlan Tsarnaev and his brother Jokar. Talk to us about it. Well, what happened here is that actually um, Jeff Bowman, who it was in that famous photograph in the wheelchair, you know, his legs. The poor man who lost yeah, his legs. Lost both legs. He actually saw the man who put the bag down next to him. Um, he looked him straight in the eyes, and when he woke up from his anesthesia, he wrote a note. He asked for pen and paper, and he wrote a note and said, saw the guy. And uh, you know, and gave the FBI a description. Even as he was still in intensive care, still suffering these massive injuries, he was able to describe what he had seen to the FBI, a man in a hooded sweatshirt, a dark jacket, wearing a baseball cap. And he said, I, I don't know which of the two he saw. We can't obviously confirm which of the two at this point, but he did say that the, the person he saw was about his age. And he's 27. So he helped the FBI at, at, at least know yeah. where to look. And what happened after that? Uh, what happened after that, I'm, I'm not really clear. I mean, they, they used a lot of video to, to locate this man that... that well, we understand described. they went through possibly thousands of clips, security, you know, security camera images, hours and hours and hours of tape trying to figure out, and possibly tape submitted by the general public, mm -hmm. trying to figure out who this person was, who these people were. Yes, they did. And then how were they able to identify them? That I actually don't know.